Alright, first, I want to make sure that if anyone in this room considers themselves normal or ordinary or mediocre, well, like, I want to see a show of hands. Who considers yourself normal? Okay, everybody, just raise your hands. <laughs> Fuck off. No, no, no. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. No, but seriously, like, just know that this is not a hate poem to all of you. It's more like a love poem for everyone who doesn't fit in that category. No, that wasn't a disclaimer. It was more like I'm taking out an insurance policy on this piece. So if brainstorms cause too much water damage on your mind to try and understand me, you won't all sue me in the form of jiggling your keys. See, I'm not, a I'm not a registered citizen to normality land. I've been there a couple times, but I try to do that as little as possible. Problem is, as little as possible, yo, that's fucking big. And I just don't belong there. But there's so many people who, like, want to ask me stupid questions like, yo, Noah, why are you okay with not belonging in normality land? Um, let me, uh, take a few minutes to contemplate that. Cuz can! I am just sick and tired of explaining myself to the human race, and I know that's exactly what I'm doing right now, but still, normality is just this fantasy of all the mentally, mentally suppressed or mindfuck people in the world, but why? Why be normal when you can be abnormal? I mean, doesn't everybody want abs? And anyways, normal is the shittiest type of Pokemon ever. I mean, seriously, they don't do anything. All they do is they just tap you and they're like, oh, you are almost dead, and now you're almost, almost dead. You know, your HP went down a little bit. <laughs> okay, see, I spent over 16 years trying to think Wait, I don't have to think outside the box. So I spent over 16 years trying to think inside that 100 mile radius around the box and I finally decided, fuck it. I mean, I have like over 9,000 better things to do than try to think like everyone else, especially when everyone else doesn't even think like everyone else, but there's so many people who think that they do and I just can't think like that. I just want to be able to, I want to be able to say that my favorite color is teal without being looked at like, oh, yo, why is your favorite color teal? I mean, you know, most people like primary colors. Yeah, well, do I look like most people? No, I'm an individual who fucking loves Teal. It's one of my middle names. You, know you should act normal. You should walk normal. You should talk normal. You should eat a cheeseburger. Yeah, and you should eat a dick. <laughs> and I, don't mean that, like, I don't mean that in a homophobic way or anything. I mean, like, it's not attached to a human body. Like, I mean, like, you go outside, right? And you, you go in your car, and it's going to be all dark, and then you're going to drop your keys. And you're like, oh shit, I dropped my keys. And then you're going to go to grab it. And just this huge penis will erupt, it'll burst forth from the asphalt, and you will devour it. And now you're at it, why don't you go burn in a fire? You would love it over there. You know why? Guess what colors the fire is? It's red and yellow. Those are primary colors. <laughs> See, you want to be normality land? I feel like peace in a public elementary school, out of place. And whatever you think is, you know, abnormal or you know, weird because it's not normality land. Yeah, that's everywhere that's not normality land. You know, who's weird now? <laughs> Noah, why are you so weird? Because can. And because I am the anti-normal, bitches.